Hi Virgo, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Virgo, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Virgo. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Four of Wands, and this is Fire Energy, Sagittarius, Aries, Leo Energy. So this is a card of relationships. This is celebrating something. It's like a milestone or a goal has been achieved in love here. Um, a connection is becoming more defined in some way here. So let's see what the rest of the cards have to say. Okay, we have the Three of Pentacles, Earth Energy, the Four of Swords, Air Energy, and the hermit virgo energy so there could be someone who you separated from with the four of swords and the hermit it's like you could have taken a break from this person um but there's an energy of a lot of growth happening during this time apart um i do see a possible reunion here with the four of wands and it looks like it's a successful reunion after a period of um you know spending time apart the hermit being here shows that this time apart has been beneficial um someone has done a lot of soul searching a lot of introspection and um there's a lot of spiritual growth that has occurred here because of the separation um it looks like you guys are coming back together and being on the same page with that three of pentacles there's this energy of wanting the same thing and you know really focusing on building a strong foundation building something long lasting something long term something solid and um you know becoming a team and it, it looks like progress is being made there's this energy of a step in the right direction, a, a major goal being achieved. So let's clarify these cards, uh, Virgo. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the world card, and this is fixed sign energy, Taurus, Leo, Aquarius, Scorpio energy. So this is also a card of success. There's this feeling of something becoming official, something being recognized, feeling like something was worth it, um, feeling like, you know, you guys have accomplished something here. Okay, so let's see. Okay, we have the Queen of Swords, Air energy, the Six of Swords, Air energy, and the five of pentacles in the reverse earth energy so there, it looks like a reunion a connection is being recovered there's this energy of forward movement moving in the right direction with the six of swords it's like healing the connection healing together coming away from a difficult turbulent situation and moving towards calmer waters you guys could be having an important discussion here as well with the queen of swords where there's a lot of honesty um, but whatever this discussion, this communication is, it's leading to the rebirth of this connection. In fact, it's like this connection is better this time around. It's stronger because of the separation that took place. Okay, so I'm going to pull out an oracle card for you, uh, Virgo. We have the end of a tough cycle approaches full moon in capricorn so it, it does look like something is coming to an end like uh, a break or a separation whatever it is is an energy here of things getting better from here okay so i'm gonna put another card for you We have forgiving and learning. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moments. So it does look like you're you're forgiving and learning each other. There's this feeling of learning from some sort of a breakup or a disappointment in love, a separation, and forgiving each other and having some sort of new start in love. 
um, if you don't have a person there's also an energy of it's like a, a period of being single is coming to an end because we have this relationship card here and we have the world so it does look like you're not going to be alone anymore there's this feeling of um, working on something with someone and having something stable like a commitment or you know a partnership someone you can rely on okay so i'm gonna pull out another card for you virgo Okay, we have white rose new start and wisdom knowing yourself is the beginning of all wisdom that's that hermit energy there's this energy of learning from something understanding yourself and being better better equipped to be in a in a more um, compatible functioning stable fulfilling relationship okay so i'm gonna pull out a card for your advice virgo We have surrendered to spirit. Once you've done everything you can to achieve a goal, turn the situation over to the divine. Let spirit work its magic for you. Okay, so that's what I'm seeing for you, Virgo. I hope you have a really, really good day, Virgo. Bye, Virgo.